Ayan ang party nun. Ito ito may kaya kiwa ang nama kaya ay rupa kaya ay winita. Ito ito rupa kaya sa tala mga buta. Mga upada, mga upada ay gana ito. Dapit may sarili. At tala mga dato kaya mabimay nga din ay upada ay rupa. Kaya magkala. Kaya din ang mga dato ay iwan. Ito ito. Ini saya yang kiri, evan ini perincian kaya sangkari, kaya sangkari itu mana yang asal se prasasa kene, abis me kaya sangkara, asal se prasasa kene kaya ni se, atukah se sangkari, buat asal se ketua. So this is continuation on the yesterday talk. So firstly there was a reference to body or bodily formation, so. Bodily formation when we talk about because this was in and out breathing sutta. So in this case, the bodily formation actually is the in and out breathing. Uh, when we say body, uh, that means the four elements and the mm. second uh, from that is there is like something called derived materiality. So comes is that uh, includes also whatever we get out of food and so on. But anyway, <coughs> the, the, this, the bodily formation, what is meant is the in and out. Ah, then digata usma karno, digata, digata usma pita karno. Digangwa, digangwa asanto, digang asami di pajana. दीर को उसमें करता दीर को पिटा करा ये तो उधर में दीर का आसवास प्राप्त हुआ थे में मदद में एक ही काया प्रकट करा इंद्र काये में में अरे अब इस जगह का काये संकार क्यों एक ही प्रकट हुए लाती हैं इंद्र ने में आसवास प्राप्त हुआ थे करा उन्हें तो पीट लाती हैं so as the meditator observes the breath that is in the sutta mentioned, the short and long, like breathing in short and um, breathing out short and uh, breathing long and breathing out long. So the, the, the short or long in or out breath means uh, the, like one gets the practical side or practically know the body of the bodily formation. Oh, then after that, the only thing, the only thing we did was to do that. That is, we did that to do that. We are not going to do that. We are not going to do that. We are not going to do that. So then, this meditator follows or observes the breath, in breath and out breath. Without being disturbed by the hindrances. It's like there is good understanding of the body. So there is kind of good awareness with that. So there is kind of good awareness with that. So this awareness is kind of good awareness with that. One of the prominent quality is unscatteredness of the mind, settledness or establishment. So here this unscatteredness is called sati. Oh, it would have been sati nita, avikshepe nita, avikshepe ariyat dhanagan negata keno. And the, then there is a factor that understands that, that the establishment and unscatteredness is happening and that is the wisdom aspect, the knowledge. So, uh, it's not that you uh, develop something extra. So the meditator really observes the breath within that. Uh, when the breath is closed closely, observed closely, uh, there is understanding about the body, bodily formation. And the establishment is there. 
वर्तमान प्रतिवेक्त आवाजना प्रतिवेक्षर मोनोदेटिंग मैं So once this starts happening, according to how I understand it, so the uh, sati is there, understanding is there, and this is there is exclusive diverting of the mind, let's say, towards the object, and that this goes on. So this that the pachcha vekana starts happening, pachcha vekana knows that it came up to this point and. This was already uh, like happening, so there is the reflection knows what was happening. Count that the things that were happening that happened, so that it, it has come up to this point that is happening just now. So it was the aramane prakatavam tere ne kada pratyekta kela kima ati ta aramane atekka. So this like was the knowledge of the object together with. the like past is what is being uh, for this uh, reflection that the many giri mata maita ne so anyway that is still within the, the notice so many giri honda to many gana kota honda to me to me satya honda to pita tino satya pita tino gen ena badi titiya ha eto to vikse avikse payak ne eto to me एक तो कि ऐ तो उड़ा तू है ना सद्धाव सद्धाव है तू है ना वीर्य है तू है ना सत्य है तू है ना मैं सत्य आ आ वीर्य से समाधि है तू है ना पंजाब है तू है ना इन्हीं दारों में पाहा सो दिस इस दिस ऑल द एक्चुअली ऑल द फाइव स्पिरिचुअल फैकल्टीज वर्क सो दैट इस फेथ एंड कॉन्फिडेंस 
has started me this because without that it cannot happen. Sati is established as was already mentioned. Uh, the mind is unscattered, is very well uh, uh, recollected, and there is knowing that these things are happening means the wisdom. Samadhi Panya can give one minute. Let the Tamai, that yet I do. But the Sokas now saying the Sati kind of uh, concentration and wisdom aspect of it is anyway something that is uh, like there we, we uh, something that like thank it is because of the sati let's say. So then, as, as for the understanding, there is understanding of, like, they call them uh, universal characteristic and, uh, like, specific characteristic. So those two are understood by the knowledge or understanding. So now this, this uh, universal characteristics is the three characteristics, they are the universal one. The, the specific characteristic is like, uh, I simplified like, for the earth, it's the earthiness of the earth is the specific characteristic. <laughs> Satyantama <laughs> Solaksana Pudulaksana or Tenaka, Genari, Vidya, Sati, Samadhi, Panya or Tenaka, Sati and Genari, in other Solaksana is an agani, Samani Laksana is an agani, Nani. In Nani, Nani, Kota Sata, Pahata, we are. Pahata, we are going to make a sitting eyeing una. As far as the practice was, they So then after. The level, so like again it went through the like noting then the non non uh, non grasping and non conflict meaning sati and knowing about that meaning ah, understanding that and then this that this directing uh, happened and a uh, reflection and this that the five uh, spirits of this arose up to the level of this understanding of the uh, universal and specific characteristics so when that happens this uh, like uh, letting off or abandoning happens so from this that means then uh, in and out breathing is kind of uh, like abandoned so what, <coughs> what is meant by the abandoning is the five hindrances are abandoned <laughs> Continues to uh, this is in Pali, these two words appear very often Bhavita and Bahuritata. Like uh, in uh, English, you might say often and a lot. So, so you just develop the same thing often and a lot. Never the Nauta, never the Nauta, Karano. Ekadaza Bhavan, the Mega Tiwagi, Tumana Deka Kala, Matra Kala. It was the I tell a duke chama tell dala, it was part to go on the Yemek and Neme made a big kitten. So it's not like people that come here for one week or so and then go. That's uh, it's, it's 
doesn't work like that. So, so, so this is like ongoing, long time practice. Uh, so then, after this, uh, again, and again and again, uh, a lot and often happens. Then the next level is the realization. Oh, things that can be realized uh, are being realized. Ega, ega so these things they belong really to within the understanding. So then the realization. Sukhavatenda kinega, Dukhavatenda kinu, Atmavatenda ka, Anatmavatenda kinu, Nibbinda tikkira kya ni, Nandiya kya ni, Satutuin te na, Satutuin ne, Helena te na, Helena ne, Me, Atarindo na te na, Atarindo ne, Rode, Hina te me, No adi, Patinisadja tikkira kya ni, Helena to Atarindo ne, So this is, then According so they are now seen as Nibbida, this turning and they are disenchanted. And things that normally they are taken, like the attachment happens with them. So then they are seen with this dispassion or non attachment. And so, 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 so there is this arising nature or originating nature is sometimes normally graspable things from now the, this, the cessation nature. And the last one is Patinis and is like a big public relinquishment. So normally the tendency is not to give up things or not completely. So then now they are seen correctly as something that is just being relinquished completely. So, so these are called the seven, like the word anupasana is very often translated as contemplation, which is not very uh, fortunate, it's not very good, but uh, you don't have proper word for it. So I prefer like uh, thorough observation might be better than that. Oh, and it's done better than the camera. And that's done better. Thorough observation of impermanence, suffering, non-self, uh, turning away, uh, non-attachment, cessation, and completely relinquishment. So this part is also part of sati, of, 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 sorry, of uh, knowledge, of understanding. Things like the exclusive turning towards the object and the reflecting and uh, the, the arising of the spiritual faculties is, uh, is within the sphere of sati really, but this one is within the sphere of understanding. So, Rakhane, Kodu Rakhane, I, me, Niman, me, Atobat, Kiri, I, ek nevata nevata, ana pane, me, ni, Kiri, I, eto bolte me, aur manohari aur bohot karnu hai kela kya ne, aniche dukka ana taki ne, tika aur bohot kar kya ne, ma, ai tiye ni na ne ta. So, this uh, understanding the 
it has a common uh, and uh, specific characteristics as well as uh, the kind of abandoning nature uh, again and again developing and realizing what can be the things that could be realized which means these seven uh, sort of these seven thorough observations uh, sort of contemplations all these things belong within the understanding so the other panyane so so why it's given this light it's anyway it should be showing how this establishing of sati really is preparing or paving the path for the understanding so these things are things that are experienced or understood without the practice, in the practice. One is paying attention, noting the in and out breathing. Is that the body, bodily part of the experience as well as the mental part of the experience become uh, like separated out or delimited and understood as separate things? So within this understanding, a part of the to do with the body is understanding that, that the in breath and out breath they have to do with the material or the body bodily part of the part of the experience. And is here especially this bodily formation means the in and out breath. Something and anyway, anything to with the body that is understanding how it is uh, something just a combination of the elements. So like a first then experience that this body is going on with uh, is this uh, in and out breathing. On that one, the eight eaten is a repeated and nothing is a hang a kaya under the gatta. I got a kino tati. I kill. So this can happen only because there was a very well, hmm. the practice was well established, that means there was such. So that is if there is no holding on to and no non conflicting as well as this non scattering. Understanding that arises and can arise only because of this the practice being established like that. Is the wisdom or understanding part. So for the sati there is part, for the understanding there is also part. So for the sati there is part, for the understanding there is also part. So this sati together is the attention uh, leads to this exclusive uh, turning towards the practice or the exclusive application.
ප්‍රතිවේක්ෂාව කරනකොට මේ ශ්‍රද්ධාව තියෙන නිසා වීරිය තියෙන නිසා තම මේ විදිහට මේ තේරෙන්නේ කියලා දන්නවා because this exclusive application happens one is able to have the reflection about what is happening now and how it came to that which is the reflecting and the, because of this the exclusive uh, application or uh, ज्ञान दुखना विशुद्धिया දැකීම නාම රූප තේරුම් ගැනීම දීති විසුද්ධිය so then uh, it's is friend this way so because you on like pay attention to your practice that this there is a kind of aspect of um, restraint or but actually restraint or guarding <coughs> or self control or something self self discipline which means the the seal is purified and the so. purification of virtue happens it is because right. the mind is unscattered and recollected that uh, as the practice goes that means the purification of mind happens and because of this understanding is arising uh, purification of the so it is nirvana yata patthela nirvana anti hende idak nathu राधे अनिच्छा दिन देख देखा मैं नहीं करना एक दिन क्यों दर्शन नहीं आएगा विपसना आएगा ये विपसना आएगी नहीं करनी था अतः का तपान्या आदि पान्या आए। So this uh, when we know or know about things because we practice uh, that means uh, this knowing or understanding can happen only because you see the things. so that's the purification of view and that is uh, now at this level is uh, together with the insight uh, 
reflect this and that is called the higher uh, higher wisdom. Oh then me kaya adamanu kan ne kai kakne me kaya kiyala kiyanne tuta satana ma bhoote ma dakala e wage ma tama vedanawa aasada paasada kanna kota vedanawa te denu So this is this was everything connected with the body so when one pays attention to the inner now breathing one also understands this vedana so called feelings or experience vedana on that one prakata va terena so as as the body was very thoroughly first and experienced or known likewise it happens with vedana dukha vedana on that terena dukha vedana as of the man this as the suktas give us the list the that plus bodily pleasant bodily uh, unpleasant and mental pleasant mental unpleasant and uh, neither pleasant nor unpleasant and so on these different like kinds of vedanas are very first hand thoroughly understood no dite on the tempati mati no ani e tempati ma dukha vedana so with the calmness kind of settledness of mind there is a kind of comfort or pleasant feel alamune peeta nati gati ari amari mene gadanda edu dukha vedana so when the object is on unclear or the no thing is not cannot happen or some is failing or things like that what is experiencing unpleasant feel ඒ ආරමුණ මෙනේ කරනකොට වේදන ආරමුණ ඒකේ මේ අදුක මාතුකේ මේ සිත පීතන පීතන් නැහැ සෝ දැන් ද නීට ප්‍රසන්න් නෝ අන් ප්‍රසන්ට් ඔක් ඔක්සස් ඉට්ස් සම්තිං ලයික් ඉට්ස් අ කයින් ඔෆ් බෝත් ඔෆ් ඉට් හැපන්ස් ටුගෙදර් ඉන් ඔව් ඒ වේදන ආරමුණ the object is being noted but also not fully or something e e ke e e vedana ma karadarayak nathuwa ara sukha ho dukko adukka matuwa me vedana wada tara wenna vedana vedana bawa danagana enaba thiti tiyatama avichepe satiyai kiyala kiyana so if one does not hold on to the pleasant ones or conflict with the feelings or experiences and just knows them for as they are that means the mind is uh, uh, what ha- what works in the mind is sati and the practice is now established oh. well established is that the is that the matter mai me honda da vitte pen inno kota me dana gane ma ati karanne etoda vedana me me ekak kela So when this is happening, there is very clear knowing that these things are happening, and that is the wisdom aspect. Vedana vai, Vedana vai, Satya inyane. So like before, we had the first hand body experience, establishment, and understanding. Now we have feelings of Vedana or the experiencing. Uh, the practice being established that means uh, unscattered and uh, non grasping and non conflicting and clearly knowing so okay. it's the sati and uh, the understanding is uh, about knowing e vedana menna me vidhi sada vedana va adukha matukya dukha vedana va kiyala me avajjana janna so at that point the mind very the like exclusively turns towards whatever the feeling might ha- happen to be so whether it whether what is that at that point happening is pleasant unpleasant or neither pleasant or unpleasant the like mind or the attention is like exclusively turned towards that uh, so that is again this ex- exclusive application of the vartamane tin rupaya वर्तमान दिन वेदना आवाय ये प्रतिविक्रय करना आती थे तो हमारी देखा मत तेरुंगानो आरामने। So in the first, this was already 
practice thinking. Came to that, so there is again the reflect, uh, reflecting nature also, so the, this is the object that happens, part of that like uh, means all the succession. ो <laughs> So this, uh, no, this part of the reflection is this understanding the object, past object meaning just like a say past moment object that was not stopped and then a new one is arising in this case it, it's the feeling that is being noted. So the reflection understand things, understands or knows, sees things like that. भावना <laughs> भावना <laughs> So, so this lokam says actually uh, uh, these day uh, teachers very often they kind of come up to the level where they get a little bit this practice gets a little bit established and uh, uh, they come to this level where these spiritual faculties start happening in the practice and then they go home and they become like the teachers so we got there and get there ोकन मैंडक्शनफुलसि is now actually becomes scattered and not collected anya in the kind of thing or the kind of ambin so then the things that could be seen with wisdom are not seen satyat bhagya itamati because only the, uh, the like half of the sati was there in the very first satyat piti va pasti idangata eka me bodjanga bawad ne pattenne The exclusive application or turning the mind to, towards the object and the reflection nature, and is that the five qualities of the mind starts growing. So that's the level of the indriyas and balas, and when this understanding about the specific and universal characteristics starts happening, it's the actual level where. These uh, qualities be start becoming the enlightenment. So, you know, Nirvana, I mean, that's what. 
the other part. So at that point, the hindrances are really well suppressed. It is the other part of the body that is 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 the body. It is exactly because the hindrances have been so well suppressed that these qualities are called the enlightenment at first. So then what happens, those enlightenment factors are cultivated. So that when we talked about, uh, again I did, like one translation I use was again and again you do it or you do it a lot and often so it this it actually ref, and it, what, it, what was said was that these good qualities or what you were doing before but what it really refers to is um, now these good qualities or the practice came to the level where what is working there is the enlightenment oh, especially in connection with the reflecting there is this knowledge that and understanding and seeing how the practice has happened this this way up to reach this point so, so now this is uh, the last bit that was called the things that could be realized are realized. It does not refer to like the big realization like enlightenment realization, but Buddha so if you know the suttas, there are some suttas of Buddha says there are things that are to be realized means like uh, like first hand experientially understood really and that is like the what happens so like uh, if, if we simplify it you need to understand about the impermanences impermanence so and so on so that starts being realized or understood uh, practically anyway that's good then me so this observing the impermanence and so on, this is what is called the Bhavanas. Again and again you need to observe the impermanence happening. Oh, or not happening, like being there. We should be so we have seal our virtue and but that is also the purification of virtue so you need to bring uh, this purification of virtue needs to happen so because um, the mind can be kind of calm, but another uh, level is the purification of mind is where really the mind is very much recollected and unscattered because of the practice. So then the mental and material or similar things they are well understood means seen, so that is the purification of being. So now if this happens, then uh, the practice becomes the inside practice, then the, that is like another term used is the higher virtue, higher mind and higher wisdom and that is explained here as uh, happening together with the insight practice. The explanation here is that uh, when things are see, uh, when these observations, this seeing the impermanence, suffering and so on has, is happening within the practice, then they are called the higher virtue, higher mind and higher wisdom. 